never before seen footage pulling back the curtain on a love story that captivated the nation. I look forward to getting to know Colin's family uh, more. Uh, still yes. sticks in my craw today. She's going to be called my wife on Sunday. Who did that? Or did that? Hey, man. Hey, man. Yeah. <laughs> John F. Kennedy Jr.'s September 1996 marriage to Carolyn Bissett on Cumberland Island off the Georgia coast, now part of an upcoming TLC documentary. His longtime friend Billy Noonan filmed it all on a handheld camcorder and licensed his video to the filmmakers. She was drop dead gorgeous and uh, funny and sassy. She could be edgy, and um, I think John liked that. It was a little different angle than, um, than his world. The political spotlight trained on him since his earliest days in the White House. After his father's assassination and this salute seen around the globe, John F. Kennedy Jr. blossoming on his own. Quarter century ago, my father stood before you to accept the nomination for the presidency of the United States. Becoming an attorney and very eligible bachelor. It wasn't until after he got to college that he sort of morphed into this, um, to the sexiest man alive. For their wedding, the famous bride and groom prioritizing secrecy. You guys ready for all of this? You better believe it. The guests taking a private plane to Florida. You kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. Then boarding a small boat motoring off the coast of Georgia. How I owe all of you? Uh, a great debt of gratitude. Uh, I realize that we impose certain conditions upon this event. At the rehearsal dinner, John F. Kennedy Jr. thanking the guests, co-conspirators in secrecy, then turning his toast to his bride-to-be. How changed my life in a way that I never thought was possible, and uh, just made me tonight the happiest man alive. So, uh, the next day, traveling off-road to the wedding ceremony in jeeps and pickup trucks, following paths untrackable by paparazzi to a secluded church in the woods. Great new church. Yeah, it's dynamite. It was amazing to have experienced, and when I look at the video now, I realize how magical it was and how special it was. Noonan says he was supposed to have dinner with JFK Jr. the night his plane went down. Now, you may wonder why Noonan, who knew how hard John and Carolyn worked to keep their wedding private, would make these videos public. He says they were just sitting in a shoebox collecting dust and that as we approach the 20th anniversary of their deaths, he wanted to celebrate what was the happiest day of their lives. He presumably was paid for the video. Yes, so well. he licensed the videos. I, I, don't, I felt kind of creepy watching it because right. you knew... Privacy was so important to them. Yeah. It was it, everything. It's interesting to, to, after all these years, to, to put them out there for people to see. Yeah. Like that. By the way, you can watch the full documentary. It's on TLC this Saturday. And thank, thank you. you. Thank you, thank you.